All right, yo diggity. This uh, video is for, um, oh, I'm hearing a little feedback-ish. Hopefully that's better. Um, okay, so this is about my uh, coffee oil that I am sending out. Pocket Buzz, Pocket Coffee, Mocha Face, Coffee Face. I'm not actually sure what the name is yet, but I am doing this video so I don't have to just repeat myself a bunch of times to the people I'm sending it to. Um, so, first of all, what you need to know, um, when you get it, you know, you're going to have to, like, rub it on you, you know, get it going until it wants to come out, right? And you, okay, so if you need a little buzz or a little quick pick-me-up or something, long day at work or long drive or whatever, dude, this was such a lifesaver on my road trip. But depending on how much you put on, it could be a half a cup of coffee to two cups of coffee or whatever. And that's fucked up because I'm going to be up all night now. Now, you do want to rub it in because, I don't know, I don't know not right now, but um, the coffee and cacao essential oils are dark, so you could have dark streaks on your face. Also, this tastes basically like um, one of my coffees that I would make or that I've done videos about. So it has um, everything I put in my coffee and then some. You have the coffee, cacao, it's all organic by the way, uh, cinnamon, allspice, anise, ginger, nutmeg, vanilla, um, oh, and I did put a little bit of cardamom, and uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, and uh, so the carrier oils is mostly coconut, and I used a little almond, kind of get that nutty coffee thing going. Um, <laughs> like me, yeah, so, because nuts are cool. But uh, yeah, so provided you don't have any allergies to any of that, they are all, all organic, they are essential oils, um, and yeah, just simply, you can inhale, but definitely put it on, especially if you have like a mustache or something, and allegedly, you know, um, coffee essential oil is allegedly good for hair growth, to stimulate hair growth, or for cellulite. Uh, so I don't know if you have a place you want to say maybe stimulate some hair growth or uh, get rid of a little uh, cottage cheese then go ahead and try it there but um, yeah it should definitely keep you going the distance um, without the side effects of coffee the stomach ache shaky nervous agitation it's just very calm and subtle but it's yeah, it's really real, like a, it's like a pocket buzz, so, yeah, and by the way, if you're better at coming up with names than I am, and you have any ideas, then go ahead and let me know, but yeah, I wanted to let you know that. Also, about my other oils that I've sent out, um, there were so many things, and I forgot to tell everybody everything, but, uh, one of the things, first of all, my healing oils are made with emu oil, why? Because emu oil has the best uh, transdermal properties, okay? So when you're working with essential oils, like, we want to treat the organ. We don't want it just to stay on your top three layers of skin, right? So because of that, it's thicker than other oils, and if it's colder temperatures, uh, where you, and like we've had, dude, we've already been in the 30s, which is, if you're on uh, Celsius, uh, 30 is freezing um, in Fahrenheit, so... I guess it's like zero, maybe, or I think, yeah, isn't freezing zero for, yeah, so we've already been there, and I noticed they got all coagulated and stuff, and, um, yeah, and in one of the other oils, I used uh, magnolia leaf and bark and flower, um, what was it, and the yarrow, there were a few that were really dark, chamomile, yarrow, the tuberose. Well, that's mm, orangey-ish, brownish, but yeah. So I wanted to let you know, just in case, like it did coagulate or whatever, just hold it in your hands, put it between your legs if you're driving in the car, up on the window, you know, by the heat or something like that. But um, yeah, so provided you don't have any allergies to the ingredients that I listed, 
Um, I'm super excited to send it, and I hope you enjoy it. Mm, and I'm buzzed, and it's too late for me to do anymore. But yeah, let me know what you think.